what is up mm, boys it is anthony swag back with another destiny video in today's destiny video i'll be going over the 2.0.1 destiny patch that came out today i'm pretty much going to be going over the main points that i think that are important and this is planet destiny's little article that they have i got off the website i'll probably link it in the description below so let's go off the main things okay so Iron Banner. Iron Banner has returned for this week. Required, required minimum character level 40, recommended light 230. So, game completion rewards have been reworked to be more valid source for Iron Banner rewards. And the match rewards now include both weapon and armor, including items available on Lord Saladin. So, say you're grinding for that pulse rifle, that's what I'm going to be doing on Saturday, Sunday, and Friday. That was in the wrong order, but say so grinding for that, boom! You didn't have to get to rank five. You can just get like that. You know what I'm saying? New emblems have been added to Lord Saladin's inventory. Okay, okay. Lord Saladin now has three daily bounties and three weekly bounties that award legendary marks. Uh, gear purchased from Lord Saladin now requires legendary marks instead of glimmer. So make sure to save up on those. And a tempered buff is now automatically applied to your character and continues to grow in effectiveness each day of the event week. Now we move on to trials. The so trials will be this weekend, 10-16 to 10-18-2015. So same thing requires a minimal character level 40, but oh, minimum light is 250. The recommended is 290. If you go in there 250, you're going to get absolutely shredded. Same thing as 290. I, I would actually recommend 300 and above, but that's just me. So, winning teams now receive trials gear rewards directly at the end of match completions. So now, that's, that's good. Players that go undefeated on their passage will continue to be invited to Lighthouse. That's good, that's good. This is a new one. Players may continue to play in the trials past nine wins, but reward the max out of nine wins. Um, the trials passage now have details. Uh, have a details page containing your boons. Uh, players must now purchase boons from the details page on their passage instead of from Brother Vance. Instead of flying all the way to the reef, you can buy right there. That's pretty good. And boons no longer. Uh, be applied to trials passage after starting a run. So what some people did was they'll get seven wins to grab the boon that went one win counts as two, and boom, lighthouse. But now you can't do that. You gotta get all your boons now, and you can't get it later. Trials gear can na can now be purchased from Brother Vance, including some items on the lighthouse. Brother Vance now has bounties that award legendary marks. Crucible bounties uh, can also be completed in Trials of Osiris, and matchmaking has been updated to make it more competitive to reach the lighthouse. That is pretty damn good. Uh, now, for some playlists. Thieves Den has been removed from the Rift playlist. Doubles. Yeah. They added Twilight Gap, Asylum to Elimination playlist, and... Removed Anomaly and Firebase Delphi from Inferno, Salvage, and Inferno Skirmish. Um, what else I think that is important Ooh, for Crucible? Shaq's weekly bounties now unlock across God all damn. characters after completing the Crucible quest line on one yeah, character. So you're true. set right there. Uh, King's Fall Raid increased the number of potential shards and added additional materials in the King's Falls first chest. Um... Strikes weekly rogue playlist now shows how many weekly bonus legendary marks uh, awards uh, remain. Uh, that is pretty damn good. I mean, I don't want um, to, but. let's see. Hold on, let me go. Oh, for the armor and exotics, players can now we will stat stat nods and upgrade nods on exotic armor via the twist fate <laughs> nod. So. The Twist Fate will require, will require Glimmer, Armor Materials, and Glass Needle, which will be sold from Zer. No and Weapons, shit. Shot Package, has now been removed from the game. Uh, 320 Black Spindle is now gone. It's 290. But hopefully you guys did enjoy this video. Make sure to like, comment, and subscribe for more future Daily Destiny videos. And hopefully you did enjoy the Unbroken gameplay. The link for this article will be linked in the description below. The first link. And... Thanks for playing Destiny for, you know, let me use this. I mean, it doesn't really matter. I don't even know who I am. But peace out, mm -hmm. bye.